Hi folks. So this is Doug Holster, the guy who has the WorksharpEasy.com uh, website and also the WorksharpEasy uh, YouTube channel. So uh, yeah, I'm in the woods here east of Sacramento with uh, a special sort of a video. It's not really all about sharpening knives this time. I've got some of those coming up though. Uh, but I'll tell you what, I have something that I'm trying to sell and you can see it behind me there. It's a really neat little teardrop trailer. You may or may not be familiar with teardrop trailers, but this one's pretty cool. So um, I'm not gonna explain much about it right now other than the fact that it is for sale. I wanna sell it uh, soon. I've only had it a little over two years. It's in beautiful condition. Uh, it's a great thing for camping. It tows easy with any vehicle with a hitch and you'll have fun with it. Um, now. I'm going to stick this little short video here, attach it to a longer video I did yesterday, about a five minute video that will show you all about the trailer. So if you are interested, uh, let me know. Um, my phone number will be in the video. and That's probably the best way to reach me or a text message to that same phone number. Okay. And look in the, um, the information below this video there and I'll, I'll um, put down an idea on a price, but below 10,000 uh, new. They're running uh, around 16,000 um, and used the same make and model and year. I'm seeing a running around 10 or 11, maybe 12,000, somewhere in there. So my price is going to be beat them all. Well, give me a call if you're interested. It's going to sell quick, so you better hop on quickly in the matter of the next day or two, okay? Hey, thanks, and look forward to more videos on sharpening knives. I made a list of over 30 videos that I want to show, show you guys stuff that I've learned since the last videos, which were years ago. So I'm going to get back in, in uh, action on these videos. Thanks. Stay tuned. Bye. Hi, Doug here. Uh, I want to show off my uh, little teardrop trailer here. It's for sale. Um, so it's a 2015 Tag Max. It's made by New Camp RV. Uh, I'll give you the website. It's N-U-C-A-M-P-R-V.com. You could check out this same model. It's still being made. It's a very popular little teardrop trailer, but um, the TAG Max, Max meaning that it's got all kinds of features. All right, uh, it's a 2015, like I say, I bought it in 2016. I've had it a little over two years. It's been wonderful. It tows easy. Of course, I'm pulling it with a truck, but any uh, RV would pull it easily, anything with a hitch. Okay, let's go take a look at it. Uh, up front, we have um, the hitch area. Um, now, there is a jack stand that goes uh, in there, um, right in there, but I put this device on there that allows me to remove the jack stand so I can drop my tailgate down. So that comes with it. But when it's on its jack stand, it's got a wheel, and you can actually grab one of these handles and easily pull it around and move it here and there, okay? So it's lightweight. This yellow thing up front is your compartment that includes your propane tank. It's a full-size propane tank, an RV battery. Um, I replaced the original with a uh, AGM battery, so that's an improvement. Um, okay, good graphics. Let's take a look. Uh, there's, of course, my contact information. If you're interested, give me a holler. Uh, let's open up, see what's inside. Okay. They have these really cool doors. I like these. Um, and this sort of a peekaboo feature, you know, you can sort of grab and, and close and open so you can see who's knocking. Um, and uh, this window is made in Germany. It, again, it pops open and it's got shades that you can open all the way or partially or close for privacy. Okay, inside, well, first of all, you got this mattress. It's queen size, very comfortable to sleep on. And let's pop inside and take a look around. Okay, again, your windows, both sides, your little small windows, doors on both sides. Um, this is facing rearward. You have your air conditioning that runs on 110. So if you're, oh, and then there's your, uh, your tuner or your um, AM, FM, CD, DVD player, HDTV, um, your outlets, you got 110. When you're plugged in 110, your 12 volt and your USB cabinets everywhere um, when it's when you don't want to use the air conditioning or you're not plugged into 110 well 
you can run your ceiling fan. It's up here in the ceiling. I love it. It's made by a fantastic fan. Uh, it's two ways, in and out, three speed. So just pop open the side windows, open the fan, and you can stay nice and cool. All right. Um, it's got, uh, well, cabinets. Let's take a look around here. This is what comes with your uh, cutting board for the kitchen sink, your remotes, and all your information. There's, up in the front, there's a headboard, and underneath is storage there. Uh, then there's your speakers and your reading lights. These are LED. Um, there's underbed storage all the way. The entire underside of the mattress. That's good. Lots of storage. Uh, air conditioning vent, antenna, top of the cradle with the fan vent. This is your kitchen area. Okay, you've got, first of all, this refrigerator. It runs on 12 volts. And you can bring it down to below freezing or bring up the temperature any way you like. You set the temperature in there. It slides back in. Really nice. Made by Norcold. It's a good brand. Um, and then you've got your stove. Now the stove is two burner propane. It um, runs off the tank up front. Made in Italy. You have a sink, a stainless steel. You pump. That's cool. Five gallons on board. The cabinets. Okay, these open, you have lots of storage down in there, and your various hooks, spice racks, and things like that, and your LED lighting. Very nice. So outdoor uh, cooking. And then on this side, you have your water, your um, 20 amp, uh, 110 volt. There's a cable TV connection. And uh, there you go. This is the driver's side and up front. Yeah, but it's for sale. Um, on the website, you'll see the newer about 16 grand. I'm selling for low, below 10. So let me know if you're interested. I replaced the fender on the passenger side yesterday with a new one. There was a little bit of some damage on that one fender. So I wanted to make this as much like new as I could. Um, but Amish made, high quality, will hold its value. It's great for camping. You're gonna love it. So give me a call. If you're interested, you come and take a look. I'm right now in Colfax, California, in the woods here at a friend's place. Talk to you later. It's Doug signing out.